Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you some things I bought for like in maternity wear for autumn. If you haven't been here before, my name's Ali. I'm a mum of three and I'm currently pregnant with our fourth baby. I'm due in January and it's October now, so I'm going to be quite big over sort of autumn-y time. So I've bought a few bits of autumn and winter clothes, so I thought I'd share with you what I bought. Most of it's from ASOS and New Look. I just order it all online. I find it much easier with maternity stuff because it's really hard to find things in the shops. Um, I'll show you my bump actually. So yeah, this is current state of bump. Not a small bump. So it's definitely in the maternity wear. So um, yeah, I'll just show you what I've got for autumn. First up from New Look, I bought some basics. Um, these are just basic vest tops. Now I know these seem like summer wear, but um, their maternity at the side so they fit really well and I wear these under jumpers um, and I'll wear them under tops when I'm breastfeeding too um, so these are really good buy I bought these in a couple of different colors I bought them in white gray and black just I like layering up under jumpers especially towards the end of pregnancy sometimes when your jumpers are just that little bit too short but you don't want to buy any more um, so it's good to have a layer on underneath. So yeah, I got those in three different colours. They were £4.50 each. Also from New Look, I bought this jumper. It's striped. It's really soft. Um, big chunky sort of striped jumpers like this are really on trend at the moment. So I kind of wanted one. I was really pleased to find a maternity version. And I really like the colours too. Um, so yeah, it's just a bit of everything. It's not too dark and stripey. Yeah, so I've already worn this actually. And it's a really nice size, so it's going to fit me well into the end, I hope. One thing I was really desperate for was some maternity pyjamas. So I managed to pick these up. I can't find anywhere sort of wintry maternity pyjamas at the moment. Um, so these are checks. I really like them. have got a cuff on the bottom, um, which is kind of important with maternity wear because depending on how high you have them up on your bump, they could be like dragging on the floor. So with the cuff, it stops that happening. So that's a really good tip when you're looking for pyjamas. These are over the bump ones. They're really, really comfy. Um, the only thing about them was they came with a vest top, which is a bit annoying. Um, it is adjustable, um, so that's great. But yeah, um, ideally I'd like a long sleeve top because it's sort of autumn, winter. Just couldn't find any um, that were reasonably priced as well. But this will be good for breastfeeding and later, so um, I picked it up and I can always wear my dressing gown over the top. Also from New Look, I bought two pairs of maternity leggings. Just find them really comfy. And I always say when I'm pregnant, I'm not going to wear leggings because, you know, who wants to live in leggings? But, oh, they're so comfy. So just for around the house or under, like, dresses, I bought these. I wouldn't actually recommend buying them because they're really, like, they're quite thin when you put them on. You know, when leggings are, look, you can see they're a little bit see-through. I think you probably need to spend a bit more on leggings on decent quality ones. I think last time I had some nice ones from Topshop, so I might have a look in there. But just for kind of around the house and stuff, these are okay. I just wouldn't wear them with like a short top. So everything else I think I got from ASOS. These are a set of t-shirts, they're v-neck, so they're quite flattering. And they're long sleeved, and obviously they're maternity, they're like quite a stretchy fabric too. Um, just kind of basics to look nice with jeans when it's a bit colder. They came in three colours. I think they were in a pack of three. So grey, black and white. I mean, the white one I've been wearing, but there's the black one. It's just quite a good staple to have, like the vest top. I also picked up a red jumper. Um, to see me through autumn and winter. It's just like a knitted... Um, I don't know what you call this thing. Stre it's stretchy anyway. So it's quite tight. It's quite tight fitting. It's not a, like a loose baggy jumper. It's a tight fitting jumper. It's quite flattering and it's just a really nice colour for autumn and winter. Be good for Christmas as well. Yeah, that was from ASOS and this is also from ASOS. It's a black polo neck jumper, which I bought to go with a particular pair of trousers actually. Um, I'm not sure how good my double chin is going to look in that later on, but um, yeah, it's quite thin. It's like a t-shirty jumper, not a thick jumper, but I bought it to go with these trousers. Now these are also from ASOS. They're like, I don't know, straight leg trousers with little cuffs on the end and they're green, which is a really nice autumnal colour. They sit underneath the bump. Um, they've got little stretchy sides as well. And they've got this sort of tie up detail here and they're really, really comfy because they're underneath the bump and they look really nice with the black polo neck. Um, and it's just nice to have something a little bit smart. So with a nice pair of black 
kitten heels these look really good or like even little black boots um and they're like a kind of crease free fabric so really easy to wear the last thing i got from asos was this dress it's just your average little black dress it's actually a little bit big for me at the moment it's hard to see black on the camera um but yeah i just thought it would look good with like cardigans knitted chunky cardigans i can wear leggings underneath it it's like a really soft stretchy jersey fabric um and you can obviously layer it up because i get really hot when i'm pregnant so um yeah i think it's just comes just below the knee um so it looks really nice with boots and yeah it's just stretchy comfy totally versatile perfect but the last two things this one came from i can't ever say this brand verbadel let me show you it's like a french online company you'll have heard of it um this is so autumnal look at this print it's gorgeous um this is really really comfy just because it's like really like loose fitting and free flowing but i would recommend sizing up if you're going for this one because it's a little bit tight across my chest and i don't really have a big chest um i really think it looks good with i put a little belt on under, just underneath my boobs so it shows off your bump really nicely but yeah it's just such a gorgeous autumn print and again i wear that with the leggings underneath and boots and the very last thing was an ebay buy and i've shown you one of these before i think a white one this is jojo mum and baby's sort of stretchy tops they're wrap tops and this whole wrap thing wraps around your bump they're really really flattering um i actually bought this on ebay second hand it's gorgeous and it's got sort of three quarter length sleeves only thing i've had to do is pin up this bit here because i find it really low i can't wrap it it keeps showing off my boob basically so um i've pinned it there but yeah it's gorgeous and such a gorgeous autumn autumnal color and it's really comfy and i think it looks quite smart as well if you pair it right with nice like, white trousers or jeans so there we are that's everything i bought for autumn maternity wear um i'm still trying to make the most out of my non-maternity wear so i'm wearing a few like bits and bobs that i can still fit into but that's not going to last very long um take a look at my previous video i'll try and link it down below or link it up here um what i wore in a week so you can see exactly how i wear the bits and bobs and see what other like my non-maternity stuff that i'm mixing into the mix and yeah hope it gives you some inspiration if you've got any hints and tips on where to buy some maternity clothes i'm going to be looking for winter clothes soon just to last me through the last couple of months so um if you see anything great when you're out and about do leave me a comment and let me know anyway thanks for watching bye